Are you, or are you not, the Messiah? I am. And soon you will see the Son of Man sitting at the right hand of God. And that was a clip from the NBC 12-part series, A.D., The Bible Continues, premiering on Easter Sunday and picking up where the hit miniseries, The Bible, left off. And here to discuss the production is Jesus, or rather, the actor that plays Jesus, Juan Pablo de Pache. Juan Pablo, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you for having me, Tanya. What an epic production. Tell us what it was like working on that shot in Morocco. Correct? Yes, shot in Morocco uh, entirely, and it was uh, an incredible experience from beginning to end. How, as an actor, do you approach playing a character as legendary and mythical as Jesus Christ? I don't think there's a right way to do it. Um, I think the only thing that I could do personally was to get rid of any preconceptions that I had about Jesus, what I had learned in my childhood, what my mother told me about him, what, you know, priests would tell me about. I mean, because everyone feels so connected to 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 him. Um, so the only thing I could do was take it almost like a blank canvas and start from scratch and see what he meant to me and what that felt like and, and give him that humanity and vulnerability. So pulling back the layers to find the man underneath all of it. Absolutely. Were Absolutely. you religious growing up? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I grew up in a religious family, um, Latin American. Half Italian. Yeah, I got it. I, I, being half Cuban, I know all about it. Your mom must have been thrilled that you were playing Jesus. I know, she was. She yeah. is. She, she is. is. <laughs> Everyone is saved now. Yeah. But um, t so tell us a bit about the journey that Jesus goes through in this series, because we pick up at what point in this story? We pick up at the crucifixion. Okay. Literally, the first 25 minutes are you know, Caiaphas and, and Pilate's trial to Jesus and then the cross straight away. Right. So we pick up uh, uh, at the crucifixion, the end of his life, and then we continue after the resurrection into the story of the disciples and how the disciples who were this tiny group of people, um, you know, built the church and built this religion that now we, you know, call Christ Christianity. Right. So that's the series. The series is, is their journey and the prosecution and and... and you know, the hardships of, of trying to make this happen. And is it portrayed very realistically? Are we sort of taken back to that period? Yes. I mean, the, the, the writers did an incredible job of giving it that grit and, and realism of today's drama. You know, yes. I think it's told in a very 21st century way in the sense that we love just seeing how people felt. You know, we are there with them uh, through their struggles. And at the same time, it's designed in a, the most beautiful way. I mean, the, the, the show looks incredible. Um, so it's a really beautiful mixture of that old historical, uh, it, you know, telling and today's way of telling it. It looks gorgeous. Now, some people may not know this about you, but you are a triple threat, <laughs> an actor, singer, and a dancer. Mm -hmm. You were in Mamma Mia, lots of other such things. Do we get to see those skills on display in this miniseries? Uh, maybe not in this one. <laughs> not in this one. <laughs> maybe not in this one. <laughs> Do you enjoy musicals as much as straight acting? You like it all, one more yeah, than the other? I, you know what? I love, I love everything. Mm -hmm. It's all part of the same for me. Right. Because um, I, I started out as a, as, a, as a dancer and started singing and then started acting pretty much at the same time. I went to like a fame school. In London? In London. So yeah. you were so global, born in Buenos Aires, you lived in London, Madrid, where else? Italy. Italy. Italy, now LA. Now LA. So, so now LA is home for you? Yes. Where LA is home is in the heart? Uh, it's a hard one, but I would say Spain. Spain. Madrid is just mm -hmm the most beautiful place in the world, I think. Well, get used to L.A. I have a feeling you're going to be very hot here, so don't go anywhere just yet. Juan Pablo, thank you so much, thank you so much for being with us today.